Hey, what's up, you guys? It's me, Comic Court, back here with another video again. And in this video, I wanted to do some more like a speculative uh, theory video in which I'm talking about OKKO. Okay, and uh, one of the episodes I wanted to talk about was uh, Final Exams. A character that normally doesn't get enough screen time in this episode gets a fair amount of screen time, not a lot, to where he's like the focus, but enough to make me suspicious that he may be like a double agent. Um, so I'm talking about Sparko and, um, there are like three instances where he shows up in the episode and I feel like this could be like a larger, like they're playing, they're, it's like they're sowing seeds to play larger, to, uh, plan out larger plot hole or plot points in the future. So we see Sparko in a flashback where he is with chip damage, Elodie, giving the, getting this power up and Enid um, catches them. The second instance is where Enid and Elodie are talking about whether uh, they want to leave or whether they want to stay. Enid wants to stay uh, or wants to leave point prep. Elodie wants to uh, stay at point prep. Enid wants to leave point prep because she doesn't agree with their practices, um, power ups and uh, giving them to heroes that they deem worthy of being um, heroes in their world and like symbol pieces like all my from my hero academia and basically the last is where he shows up at the end of the episode and he admits to Enid that he doesn't feel adequate or he doesn't feel like he's the best hero or suited to stay at point prep because he doesn't feel like he's an adequate hero and um yeah so those are like three instances where I'm just like maybe he is like a double agent and also um, what makes me uh, what makes me think about this this theory may be true is that like Foxtail is also a part of this organization, and she um had she used Chip Damage, who's revealed to be a robot in this episode, to uh, be under her control to do her bidding, and uh, basically like I, it's like I'm kind of connecting all the dots a little bit. So with Chip being a robot, there's no telling how much information he has. Um, store up in his uh, whatever database or like uh, information storage system he has like there's no telling how much information she could use to um, uh, take advantage of like other heroes or anything like that which I don't think she may do because she seems like even though she may have used ship damage under the um, under the nose of like unbeknownst to like the um, his creator the gray alien dude she doesn't like um uh, she doesn't seem like the villain villainous type now i can see like progressive venomous or like the box one robots robots using chip damages um or like stealing chip damage and using his information to get ahead or like take advantage of like uh heroes weaknesses and uh strengths and uh or like no the the weaknesses of the heroes so i can see that happening but i don't not for sure I want to know what you guys think, so hit me up in the comments and let me know if you think this double agent Sparko theory may be true or like what you guys think about this episode and let me know in the comments. Hit that like button if you want to see more geeky content like this and uh, subscribe as well. And um, yeah, that's it for me, you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Uh, bye.